Welcome to OttawaTonight.com. Uh, we're on location at the Capitol Ho down in Ottawa. Uh, it's day three and we really wanted to uh, talk about you guys uh, mainly because uh, we like featuring um, some good local Canadian talent. Not that we don't like Rascal Flats or anything like that, um, but uh, this is quite the success story um, and I was talking with your I think you guys call her your mom, your, your, your state mom. Yeah. And uh, so the story is you guys entered the contest, uh, Capital Hoedown uh, was looking for a band. Uh, they wanted to showcase uh, some great good talent here and to open up for um, Roscoe Flats. And you guys weren't too sure of entering the contest. What's up with that? You never know, yeah. You never know. That's, that's the main reason why we did it. Good you never know. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> What's really funny is the Rascal Flats, this is their, their sound check right now. I think so I think it's so you're like, hey, we're opening for you later, but you know, yeah. go right ahead. Uh, <laughs> yeah, don't worry about us. It's don't okay, worry about don't us. worry about us. Um, yeah. So yeah, so you guys entered and you know, you won, uh, which is absolutely phenomenal. You guys are out west, we're all the way here uh, in the east. Uh, so, uh, like, did you guys have a big campaign or did you have a lot of friends and family? Do you have a lot of cousins? Like, who's going? <laughs> yeah, you have a lot of relatives. Yeah. Uh, a lot French. of girlfriends? I don't know. <laughs> no, the, the neat thing about this contest is that it was completely driven by the fans. Online, so the fan yeah, base yeah. that we, that we have with Facebook, with other social yeah, media sites, yeah. rallied behind us, and that's an amazing thing to see because it takes the power of the choice of who gets to play at this event, puts it in the fans of the music, and that's killer. And you can't say enough things about that. And, then, and the great thing was, it was 197,000 votes, right? So it's not just our fans that are, are liking the music or the track that we posted. So, I mean, these are all new, these are all new yeah. 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 So, yeah. It was it was awesome for us. Hey, there's funky beats. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so, uh, I wanted to talk a bit about country music. I'm a big country music fan. I'm from a, I'm from a small town, but uh, country is really big in Canada. How you guys? Uh, how did you guys grow up doing country in Saskatchewan? I don't think any of us grew up doing country music no, in Saskatchewan. No. We listened to it. Influenced yeah. a little bit by yeah. my mum, but I grew up on Australian rock and roll. You know, okay. ACDC yeah. and yeah. the punk surf scene and stuff like that. But with Keith Urban, Slim Dusty, Lee Kernigan, for example, these type of guys in Australia that no one's heard of here, it was an inkling from my mum. And so when they came over and found out I was playing country, she's like, this is awesome. <laughs> I can't believe you're playing country. So. Yeah. So really, this is a culmination of, of four different people Four different uh, diverse backgrounds, diverse backgrounds yeah. frames of reference. As people living, growing up in Saskatchewan, it's an agricultural city or an uh, agricultural province. It's a strong country market. Mm. Even when you're driving down the road and you have AM radio on, you can't help but absorb that. Yeah. So as we came together as a unit, we all brought different things to the fold. Yeah. And I'm not going to say that the Wyatt sound is a country sound, but it has a very country yes. influence and yeah. it's driven by a lot of different backgrounds. Yeah, country is a lot. I mean, the thing is, it's so uh, versatile. It, it, it is, plays yeah. everywhere. You yeah, know, it's, it's like it's not like before where Johnny Cash you could only listen to him on you know Nashville yeah, radio yeah, or yeah, like yeah. you know the AM dial, right? Yeah, now it's, it's on you know yeah. all the all the regular pop stations. It's all over. Because the, the face of pop music changes all the time, yeah, and you guys, awesome. yeah, it really is. That's why Johnny Reed has had so much success yeah. and from a Canadian standpoint, is because he's one of the first country artists that's crossed over. Oh, we should get out of here. Yeah. Yeah. So tonight is the big night. You guys are opening from Rock. If you like, is it sink in yet? We're excited to be a part of this. We're happy to be here. Like you said, it's a great way to spend a weekend. So yeah. we're, we are yeah. excited. <laughs> the sun is shining. It's going to be great music all day. We get to play our show. So, I mean, can't get much better than that. Yeah. Yeah. And honestly, this is such an incredible festival for being the second year of this festival, oh, of the, yeah. of the ho uh, hoedown. hoedown. They they know they've done it upright. They treat the artists really well. They the, the fan experience is incredible. They they know how to run a festival, and that's I think that makes the whole experience even better Absolutely. for us. There's rumor of them taking this across the country, and that'd be massive if they did. Oh yeah, It'd be kind of like oh, an yeah. itch fest, but yes. country's yeah. version. This is a yeah. well-oiled machine. It's yeah. pretty amazing. Yeah, that's great. So about the set, because have you guys picked out your first song yet? Like this is oh, this yeah. the oh, song. Yeah. Oh, oh yeah, got had them ready all week. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, metronomes are we only, know, we only know a few songs. <laughs> yeah. We're playing three over and over and over and over. <laughs>
Do you guys agree a lot on stuff uh, like that? Or who, who's the decision maker? Or, usually you know? I do. Okay. We've all got specific usually, jobs. Yeah. Okay. I mean, we agree on it. But. Yeah. So what's the song? What's the one uh, the coming first, up with the a bang? The first one is The Mess in Me. Well, we were joking last so, night. We, after it was done, uh, the crowd was intense last night. It was massive and there was litter everywhere. And we are like, oh, we can give us a stick and we'll go out there and clean up a little bit. And maybe you guys can go and play a song tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> we didn't do that. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so you guys have planned out your, your lineup and whatnot, but what is the message? What do you guys want people to leave here after tonight, re remembering Wyatt? <laughs> we just want, really, we want them to love the music. We want them to have a good time and, uh, you know, take take away something from the songs that, that they'll remember and that they'll you know, be converted into a Wyatt fan. So that's, that's our job today. It's a tough job. <laughs> But we will do it. Someone has to do it. Yeah, it's yeah. a tough. Yeah, make it a music hard. In ten years from now, yeah. 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 when you're, you know, winning Grammys yeah. and whatnot, yeah. and you're like, I remember our first yeah. interview, and yeah. we had Rascal yeah. Flash yeah. uh, annoy yeah. us with their yeah. sound check when we were. Thanks, yeah. guys. It has to be done. It has to be done. Well, guys, Honey good luck. I mean, Thank take you. it all you're in, and uh, we wish you nothing but the best, and we definitely welcome you to Ottawa. Yeah, and thanks, thanks so for much. Thank you for taking the time to talk to us. You're welcome. Good luck. Yeah. Cowboy hats tonight? Uh, yeah, uh, not so much. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Can we after the show? Yeah.